Hey, welcome to Advise My Style. I'm here with uh, Sandra that found me on Facebook. And then, <laughs> funny thing was that we just met in a city center. And I'm like, hey, you. She's like, what? And I'm like, hey, you. Like, you added me on Facebook, not me. And she's like, oh, it's you. Yeah, yeah. Like, that was kind of an awkward moment. It was funny. So the thing is that she arrived my place today because I love these eyes. They're downturned. <laughs> hooded eyes and uh, we show you how you lift up an eye like this because she has quite moist eyelids I'm applying a loose powder over so this is a pressed powder from Sensai Canebo in shade TM03 so this is how I'll prepare my eye and then I'll be able to put an eyeshadow on it and it will just glide over because the eye is not greasy anymore so powder on powder works the best and uh, it will just glide on so the powder looks like this so she has a downturned eye here and if you look it from the side it's flat and here's the crease so it's hooded eye because this crease just goes over she cannot apply an eyeliner here up because it just breaks the line so we somehow need to lift this part therefore I'll apply a pencil this is a black pencil direct here on the eyelashes up like a little eyeliner open and I put it here in the eyelashes. I need to lift this part of an eye, so the end part. Now look down. This is really important. Now just line this part here as much as you can. Just make it black, black, black underneath. So this is an upper water line. And because you're applying black here, a little bit of black will stick also on the lower part of the eye and it will lift it. So because we're putting it here, this eye will go up and here on the inner part we might make it lighter so the eye will be like this up with it again just push the color really in here in the eyelashes just cover this part in the roots of eyelashes and I smudge it with a brush so I take a brush, I pull it up I just smudge it, work it in, work it in that it just gets a nice line, it mustn't be a harsh line. Smudge it, smudge it, smudge it. I showed you this technique before, but today we'll do it a bit differently. So this actually fits whichever eye if you want to have more cat size. Alright, look at me, close it and this is it now I'll apply a burgundy eyeshadow because she has blue eyes and I'll mix it a bit with brown so this is dark brown here I mix the two because this is how I get a warm shade for her blue eyes which I want to stand out I apply again here on the corner just pushing the brush in that the color sticks on because otherwise the color falls down see I'm making this lovely triangle here I clean the brush in my hand <laughs> what a mess I did and now I just rub it in and I make this lovely triangle here I take a 217 brush from MAC and I smudge everything there mustn't be a harsh line and the most important thing is open it that you put it here we need to put it here on this brow bone so here and don't extend it too much this part mustn't go too out because I don't want an eye to have like a wave on it I actually want just to put it on the eyelid so where the eyelid creases open do you see, just here, this is the part, just open and look at the camera, just this is the part that I cover 
it's little dark just little bit dark here and it opens up the eye alright <laughs> <laughs>